Hello students, in today's class we will study about C++ stream classes. In the previous lecture, I have already told you about stream, what do I mean by stream and C++ streams. So in this class, we will, we will study about the classes. Okay. So this is a, a hierarchy of sorry, this is a hierarchy of stream class. Okay, and here iOS is the base class. The iOS, the iOS stream is derived. Sorry, ha huh, yes, iOS stream class is derived from iOS stream and OS stream classes. The if stream and off stream are derived from iOS stream and OS stream classes. I will tell about these classes. These classes actually handles input and output with the disk files. Okay. So, and other is your, this is your input output stream, is your input output system, completely the system, stream class, sorry, input output stream class, the input output stream is your input stream and output stream so from the output okay okay so input stream and output stream generated from input output stream class this is your input file stream this is your file stream it is your output file stream it is a file buffer it is a stream buffer class and it is your file stream base okay so so uh, for this if stream off stream f stream classes f stream dot head sorry f stream dot h sorry f stream dot h is the header file okay and the iostream dot h is iostream dot h is contains iostream os stream and ios stream okay so basically these in this uh, these classes are included in the program while doing disk io operations okay. so let's talk about sorry let's talk about different streams and meaning with the description so first is your is stream so is stream is stands for input stream okay so basically this stream is used read and sorry interpret input okay this stream is used to read and interpret input and next is your o stream o stream stands for output stream okay and this output stream is used to write sequences of characters and represents other kinds of data other kinds of data okay this is a your os stream and next is your if stream
I stream stands for input file stream. Yep. So it is derived from a stream base and I stream by multiple inheritance. As you can see, it is inherited from where this it is inherited from a stream base class and I stream base class by using multiple inheritance. Okay. This class is used to assess the member functions like uh, member functions like your get. read this and it also provides open function also provides open function okay with default input mode we will later discuss about open mode close mode read mode write mode of file operation when we will study about different file operations okay then upstream It is derived from F stream base and O stream. It's your output file stream. Okay, so this class is your all output functions like put uh, or write. Okay, and other functions are also there. Okay. And uh, next is your F stream class. So F stream class is stands for file stream. File stream. This is allows uh, input and output operations. Uh, basically, allows I/O operations. I/O operations. I O operations uh, on sorry I am also simultaneously on file buffer. Okay, F stream base class is stands for file stream base. Okay, so file stream base it acts as base class for this F stream, I I F stream and off stream. The functions are open function, close function. Okay, so okay, so next is. file buffer this class contains IO operations with files okay so this is all about C++ stream classes thank you